So this is the easiest way to screen print. First, I got my screen burned by Arena Prints, I think they're called. And this came in literally like in less than a week. By having my screen burned, that takes off a whole stress and it's definitely worth the money. Then right here I have these two hinges that I bought uh, from Amazon for 13 bucks, I believe. You don't even need a screen press. All you need is some hinges and a table you're willing to drill into. And we go over here. I got these um, air dry screen printing ink from Amazon as well. I used to use these a long time ago. Then also we have squeegees that I also got from Amazon for 20 bucks for three of them. And these are definitely gonna work perfectly. Perfect. So I decided for this screen print, I was going to do separate designs for each shirt, but this literally fits perfectly onto the shirt, like all the designs. So I feel like it's going to look super cool. So I'm just going to go for it. I don't think, yeah, the squeegee's is not big enough, but it still works. Doesn't really matter. No. Oops. God, I haven't screen printed in a long time, so I could see that the ink right here mm -hmm. is kind of not on it yet. Not fully. Okay. I do recommend using a clamp, that way you're keeping it down. Obviously, I went with a very difficult design because I'm trying to cover the entire shirt, but it should be a lot easier with just a small design on a shirt. Yeah. Dang. I didn't know you were a pro. Oops. <laughs> right after. This is going to be nuts. Alright. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Print's gonna touch the freaking ground. Whoa! Hold on. Hold on. Oh god. God, it's stuck. Perfect. What the? <laughs> that is ugly. Mm. Well, it's kind of cold, but also kind of ugly. Mm, I hate the green. Yeah, it looks dumb. It just looks like like a little kid shirt. Yeah. Like a little kid Minecraft shirt, Loki. Even though it's not Minecraft. The green just looks like Minecraft. After I'm done, I just spray it with some water and scrub it a little bit with my hands and it's good for another use.
All in all, this is a very fun and easy project to do. Obviously, if you're making a smaller design, it would be a lot easier, but even doing a giant design like this wasn't too hard. If you liked the video and if you learned something new, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Okay, bye.